In this class, we are going to learn how to create a button on click of which it will print the page. Like for example, this is the page. If you want to print this page, right now we need to right click on this page and click select this print option. So we are going to automate this that is by creating a button over here at the bottom of the page on click of which it can print the page. First of all, we have to drop the button on this page. For that, I will go to code view. Now at the end of the table, I will drop the button. I am selecting the button and dropping it over here. Done. Let me go back to design. A yeah, button is displayed over here now. Select this. First, I will rename this to print the page. We tab out. Now, if you see the print the page button is displayed over here. Now, in order to achieve the use case that is printing the page, we need to create a JavaScript function for this. I will copy this function from here. Paste it. Instead of this, I will write print page that is the help of camel casing we don't want any parameters to be passed to this function and this function won't return anything here we need to go for window dot print of function that's it now let me go back to page designer we have created the function with the help of javascript now on click of the button it has to invoke this function now select this button over here go to events so under events select this plus new event and select on oj action this has created a action chain for us let me rename to print page button action change now in order to call the javascript function we need to select this call js function and drop it over here once the component is dropped to this action chain select this component and from here we need to select our function that is print page which we just now created that's it we can leave this default for return type now let's go back to page designer Now we need to preview this application. I am clicking on the preview button now. A web page has been loaded successfully. Now when I click this print the page button, it has to give me the option to print the page. Now let me click on this print the page button. As you can see, we have got the pop up. And here is the page details. Now we can print by selecting the printer and we can go for printer properties and change and we can also save to PDF and do a lot more things with this. So like this we can enable the print the page option in VBCS application that is by creating a one line JavaScript code that is window.printoff.